Good morning, my friends. Welcome back to Prophetic with Suzanne. I hope everybody's doing good this morning. I'm coming in with a quick word out of Isaiah 58, verse 11. And I'm reading this from the message. And it says, I will always show you where to go. I'll give you a full life in the emptiest of places, firm muscles, strong bones. You'll be like a well-watered garden, a gurgling spring that never runs dry. This is powerful. You know, he says, even in the emptiest places. I love this. You know, God is always pouring into us. It doesn't matter where we are. You know, I know in the New King James, it says he will satisfy your soul, you know, in the drought, that he will satisfy you, that even in the dry places, the drought, the empty places, you know, he's pouring into you all the time. God is good and he's speaking to you this morning. Even now, I believe God is really speaking to you and he's strengthening you. You might be in the waiting room right now. You might be waiting on those breakthroughs. But wherever you are right now, he says that you'll be like a well-watered garden. I love this, that I'll give you full life in the em emptiest of places, firm muscles and strong bones. God is good. And this is what he does for his children, no matter what you're walking through. When he's pouring into you, even if you don't see it yet, he's making you stronger. He's building you up. He's creating you to be more like him. You know, you're getting nurtured and poured into in ways you can't even imagine sometimes. Sometimes we don't even know what he's done in us till we get to the other side. You know, but God is making your soul like a well-watered garden. You know, so keep listening to the Lord. Keep seeking the Lord because he is building you up. He's pouring into you. He loves you. He loves you and he is carrying you through this season. He's walking before you and behind you. He is holding you up in Jesus name. So I love y'all. God loves you so much. I thank y'all for being here. I welcome all my new subscribers. I am praying for y'all. I thank you for your love and support and I'll be back soon.